Hey guys, how's it going? I'm Mega G Wolf, and welcome back to Let's Play Don't Starve Shipwrecked. As you can see, last time we decided to take a trip over the waters to reach this new and unexplored island. As you can see, there happen to be some monkey-like creatures here. Those things are going to be the end of me. Now, they are a little annoying considering uh, they decide that they want to steal things. We can examine it. Here be evil. So I don't really want to stay here for too long, considering they are, in fact, quite annoying. But there's gold. There's gold about, and I can't, I can't risk getting it because of the monkey. Hi. Do you want a, do you want a coconut? How about, hey, here you go. No. Okay, that's fine. At least he offered. You know, we offered. We thought, hey, you wanna, you wanna rock? You wanna rock, buddy? Hey, hey, hey! We'll give you a rock. Have a rock. No? Alright, well, he's picky, okay? He doesn't really know what he wants. And, and that's fine. I understand that entirely. I'll mind this a bit. Get the important stuff. He's gonna, he's gonna take his own. But, uh, as long as, as long as he's not getting in my way, we're fine. We're fine. We might not be fine, it depends. So. What do you think you're doing then, huh? You gonna just, you're just gonna stick around? Be a, a, be a bit of a nuisance? Mine, monkey man, you get none of it. Ha <laughs> ha! Alright, I'm gonna probably leave this place because this is not a good island for me to be on. It's cool that we found some gold though. That is the important thing and I've got as much as I need to make an alchemy engine. So not an alchemy engine, a science machine. Alchemy engine's next. I don't have enough for that. This guy is very persistent though. He will follow you around. Later nerd! What I thought. Alright, so where is a good place to go from here? Probably down. I say that. I have no idea where a good place to go is. But I'm going to try my best. Ooh, what? Road to Wobster Den. That Waskal is escaping. Waskally Wabbit. <laughs> hey. Sorry about that. I had to quickly unplug my microphone. Just because I noticed something weird. Either way. We'll be trying to find some land down below. It's going to be a little... Uh, a little annoying to go against the waters. Oh, actually, I can do this. There we go. Now I'm going with them, kind of. Uh, it works out. Coral Reef, eh? Am I going the right way? Uh, I'm a little bit off track now, but still, it doesn't matter that much. Wow. You can't see the bottom. Yeah, there's fish everywhere. That's cool. Look, that is really cool. So apparently we can mine these, I think, if I remember right. I don't see why, but we'll try it. There might be a good reason for it. Pick up the coral. Wet coral. Well, yeah, one would assume. Living building material. Okay. There might be a good reason for it, but at least knowing where some is is going to be pretty useful, I suppose. Okay, yeah, I am going the right way. Oh, hey, there's like... Seagulls? Shoo! Find some other water. Okay. Interesting. I don't... Ah, fuck. No! We got hit by a wave! I don't remember what seagulls do. Also, getting hit, getting hit by a wave increases your H2O levels. It'll make everything wet. It's really annoying. So I should probably try to avoid that. Oh, good! We found another island. Yeah! Escape! Okay. So, hopefully, this place will give us many treasures. Oh, wow, we're actually a bit hungry. I didn't even realize. Well, that's fine. We have enough food on us to survive another day. This is going to be like a small island. Like a tiny island with nothing on it. Oh, we got some limpets. I'll take some limpets. I'll also take uh, these guys. So, the trap up. And hopefully, we'll find some food to use. Oh, wait. This is a different island with different boxes. You know, I should probably make a home base. I don't know if this would be a good place or a home base. But I'm going to do it anyway. Because why not? 
There's no trees around. Bird, you're literally in the way. Place I wanted to put that. All right. Okay, we need two more logs though. Just so we can get ourselves the science machine to make science. We've got to make science happen. Hopefully we'll get some coconuts from this. These look bigger than the others. I don't know if they're, no, they're not fully grown. I thought that maybe they'd be fully grown in comparison to the other ones we chopped down in the first episode, but it doesn't seem that is actually the case. I think it's just luck. Unless they aren't fully grown. It could be the case. But, uh, do I have to use a machete for these? I don't remember. I think I do. Yeah, pretty sure. Hiya! Hoa! There we go. So, we should have the wood now. Science. Boop. Science machine! And we can make a lot of stuff. Stuff that we've never seen before. A sand castle? I kind of want to make one. <laughs> it means I need to make a shovel. Ah, I need more stone. There's a, thankfully a little bit over here. Because I want to make... Uh, I want to get a... No, oh, whoops. <laughs> I want to be able to make a hammer. So I need one more stone. Hello? My kingdom for a stone. I just need one. I just need one. Because I want to see what's inside these crates. I'm not going to be able to find that one on this island, am I? God damn it. Alright. Let's keep the fire going for now. We'll search for more stuff in the future. I suppose. The fire's dying out on me, though. There we go. Let's cook the seaweed. Yeah, cooked seaweed. Yum. Oh my god. It heals so much. And it's everywhere, too. Cooked limpets. We'll make ourselves some cooked coconut. Roasted coconut. Oh, that sounds more sweet, is what that sounds like, probably. <laughs> yum, yum, yum. All right, nice. So is there anything I can do with the... Oh, limestone. I've got limestone. Can make cloth. What does limestone do? Examine. Looks like a use most useful building material. Hmm. I don't know what that's used for yet, though. Oh, can I make a backpack? Oh, yes, I can. Okay. So let's do that. Uh, we'll put that there, and then we'll equip the backpack. Sorry there, little thatch pack. You'll be, uh, you'll be staying there for now because the backpack is just a lot more space to hold things. So, very nice. Alright, let's continue to see if we can find... Oh, well, no, I don't need to find another, another stone. I can just make another pickaxe. I don't know why I was being silly like that. Because I want to make this sandcastle, just because. <laughs> kind of, I haven't made it before in the series, so... So something else that you may have noticed here, the tide is coming in, which is why we decided to put this in the middle. Well, kind of, because otherwise it gets really quite awkward. <laughs> Yum. Okay, so we should have enough now for this magical structure. Oh, no, 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 that's right. We need a shovel. There we go. I don't, I don't have a lot of sticks left. That's actually quite surprising. You know, you'd think, <laughs> you'd think that you'd be able to get this anywhere, but uh, nope, you need to specifically get it from these piles. Oh my god. Build a sandcastle. Put it down here. Whoa! Okay. It's a sandcastle. In the sand. I feel like that was a giant waste of my time, but you know what? Worth it. I am king of this sandcastle. King of all, I survey. Alright, what do I need for a hammer? I need to... Oh, hey, I got a catch. Nice. Yeah! Put that back. Anything else? No. <gasps> no, he went the wrong way. But we have more sticks available here. So, this will be our little home base. It's not really that good, honestly, because 
There are areas where you can get other things. Actually, technically, the monkey area would be better. But I don't like being near the monkeys. They're quite annoying. Okay, hammer. Alright, there we go. So, equip the hammer. Let's break open these things. Oh, is that cloth? Nice. Oh, and these are gonna give me boards? Oh my god. I'm alright with that. Dang. Any more around? No, it doesn't seem like it. I'll check up here though. Never know. Because that's, that's a pretty good find. Rope, cloth, two boards. Should go back to my original island and open up the crates there. There are a lot of crates on that island, if I remember right. There's like one, two, three, four crates there. Dang. Also interesting, I didn't realize these were specific areas. They're specific, specific, specific. How big is this island? Oh, it's not that big. Which is a good and a bad thing. We made up a base here, but, you know, we didn't really do anything of worth here. But we got we got some basic stuff. So I'm thinking we'll probably head out. Murder this guy first. Uh, and put this here. Okay. So, yum, yum, yum. Let's move on. We're going to go to another island. This can be like an outpost. We have enough gold to be able to continue making other bases elsewhere. So for the time being, we will go elsewhere. Because I feel like that would be better. Alright. Because there's not a lot here. And I feel like we can find other stuff in other places. Where do we want to go from here though? Maybe right? Make it like a square? Head back to the old island? Considering we want to open up those boxes? Yeah, we'll do that. We'll see if there's anything directly right of us. Oh, hey, we might actually be able to ride the waves. Whee! Yeah, that's the way to do it. They don't really give you that much of a speed boost. It's just a bit convenient, especially if you're going with the waves. So, screw it. Why not? Oh, hey. Usually these shallows mean we're about to come up to some, some land. So I'm hoping we are, but we might not be. Let's go through... Oh, hey. There is an island here. Sweet. Another pit stop. Boing. I don't mind. Gives me a chance to see what's around. See if there's anything worth a damn. Ooh. Does look like it might be worth it, but... Not sure yet. Oh, hey. Whoa, hello. So this guy died. Pick up a message in a bowl. Straw hat. <gasps> Luffy, no! Let's read this bad boy. Okay. Ooh! I like those odds. Yeah, no, that buried treasure is very doable. I can do that. So it was really worth coming here after all. What is that? Fishbone? Fishbone? Wait. Yay! Pack em bagums! How are you, buddy? Oh my god. Hold the bottle. Uh, I guess we can get you to hold the traps. Get you to hold them and the boards and some of the refined material. Oh my god. Pack em bagums. I'm so glad that you're here. You're like my savior. This is basically our Chester. The Chester of today. And he's a flyable one, so it means that when you decide to sail out into the seas, you don't have to worry about losing him, which is nice. So he, he'll be he'll be our little pelican buddy. Helps us out. Hopefully. <laughs> Hopefully he'll help us. He might he might betray us, backstab us one day. But for the time being, he has my trust. Oh, have I run out of wood now? Yeah, I've completely run out of wood now. Alright. Well, there's a lot of trees on this island, so hopefully next time I start this up, I'll remember to chop some of those down. Because that will be useful. But apart from that, I think we've done pretty well for ourselves on this day, on this fine day. Really, we should work on making a better boat. Because we can actually make a certain boat that just has a lot of oomph. In it has a lot of speed, has a lot of defense. You can put a sail on it. 
go riding, using the waves. And that way you don't have to worry about, you know, being slow across the sea and traveling from one island to the next isn't a big chore. So that's nice. Ah, oh, he's asleep. Oh, man. Roaring fire right there. Ah, good times. Probably shouldn't have put the fire there, realizing this now. But either way, we'll see how that backfires for me in the future. Throw us a like if you enjoyed, guys. Take care. Have a lovely day. Okay, thanks. Bye.